Good morning, beautiful students, and good morning, wonderful parents. Welcome to the Independent Institute of Education's Varsity College Open Day. You could have not chosen a better educational brand to spend time with during the end of the world. My name is Oke Wasabi. I will be your host this wonderful morning. And right now, you're asking yourself, who is this wonderful four-eyed man on my screen? I will tell you, curious cat, I am an internet personality, a YouTuber, a filmmaker, and a comedian. I said the last occupation lost because of the immense pressure it brings onto people of my community. Because people meet doctors at the movies or something like that, and they don't immediately start hoping somebody chokes on popcorn at the theater so that they can see a life being saved live. But you tell somebody you're a comedian, and they expect a joke right now, immediately, right then. But today is a serious day, beautiful people. No time for jokes. It's the beginning of the rest of your life. And I'm not really talking to you students. I'm talking to you parents. The parents who are exhausted, simply tired, from being asked to learn this month's TikTok dance for their child's latest upload. Parents, believe me, you've played your cards right. Just by you being here, you're one step closer to sending off your beautiful offspring to new frontiers where the couple of years spent here at this wonderful educational brand will have them ready to spread their wings, ready to leave the nest, embark and conquer this ever-changing new world and be equipped with the tools for new world thinking. New world thinking, that's not just a buzz term or catchphrase. In fact, today is all about showing you how we at the IIE's Varsity College think the opportunities that we provide, and introducing you to the people that will be guiding you along your journey. Alongside our broadcast stream, we have a live stream chat panel. We encourage you to engage with our presenters and ask any questions that you may have. The world is transforming every single day. We have no say on how quickly the new world comes at us before we get to adapt. Just look at what you and I are doing right now. I mean, students, back in my day and back in your parents' day, open days were live. We actually got to go on campuses, see new faces, meet new people, shake hands, check out if they sell nice pies at the school's cafeteria. If your parents just had you a year earlier, you'd probably be experiencing an open day live at one of our eight varsity college campuses around the country. But because of this unexpected circumstance around the world, this is unfortunately where we are. But instead of just depriving students of this informational day and experience, we're bringing the eight campuses right to you, right now in your favorite pajamas. In situations like this, you always have three options. Sit back, do nothing and watch the world pass you by, or apply critical thinking skills and adapt, or build a time machine. I myself always try my best to adapt, but I'm currently trying even harder to figure out time travel. In the meantime, here at Varsity College, we've adapted and applied new world thinking, but more on that later. Right now, we are on our first date. I know so much about you. You're a young adult. Your hobbies include texting, blocking your parents' profile on Twitter, prepping for the metric exams, and constantly updating your meme folder on your phone. But how much do you know about us here at Varsity College? Well, since you asked, I'll tell you, Varsity College is an educational brand of the Independent Institute of Education. The Independent Institute of Education that I keep mentioning is registered with the Department of Higher Education and Training as a private higher education provider and is accredited by the British Accreditation Council, which is an independent authority in the United Kingdom that accredits private providers globally. Blimey, mate, that's right, the IIE is recognized in the UK. Now, isn't that just jolly? I apologize to any British people on the stream whom I may have offended with that accent. I'm really still trying to master it. Anyway, where was I? Oh yes, I was telling you about VC. Varsity College has six academic schools, all governed by the IIE. So like faculties, basically. So it's the School of Management, School of Law, School of Psychology and Communications, School of Finance and Accounting, School of Education, and the School of Information Technology. IIE degrees, diplomas, and higher certificates are offered on our eight Varsity College campuses. We here at Varsity College also believe in balance. I think the saying says, all work and no play makes for a Netflix subscription unused. I think the guy who fixes our TV remote said that, but I also think it applies to life at Varsity. You have to blow off some steam, right? We encourage students to live active and engaged student lives that also include academics, sports, and social components. That's one of the other places you might see me next year, as I'm currently in talks with Varsity College to become the school mascot. In fact, I designed the costume which I'll be in. 
Okay, so picture this. It's a huge sea wave. Sea is in like ocean, ocean vibes, you know? But that sea wave is shaped like a V. So it's a V C. Do you guys get it? I'm always thinking, guys, always coming up with ideas. My mind is always working, you know? Call me after this if you need ideas. For more information, you can always check out our website at varsitycollege.co.za. That is also where you will find all relevant forms for applications and registration. Don't forget the IIE degree application closing date is on the 13th of November and registration opens from the 7th of December. Also, on the bottom right of your screen is a prospective student live chat where you can talk to student advisors who can already give you valuable advice and guidance on becoming a 2021 student. You also have the option to book a student appointment with a student advisor should you wish to through the events page. We've got a wonderful experience lined up for you today, beautiful people. I might or might not be giving away some prizes, some top secret prizes. Okay, spoiler alert, the prizes might be bursaries and some clothing vouchers, but stick around, you'll hear more about this later. On the events page is a schedule of the events. Make sure you follow the times on the schedule of events as events will begin promptly and I advise you to be there five minutes early not to miss out on any presentation that may interest you. Now, to show you a little more, our Managing Director, Louise Wiseman, will introduce Varsity College and what we stand for. To date, 2020 has been a year filled with emotions as we have been required to socially distance from our community base as well as feel the real impact on the economy. We really appreciate you joining us virtually today during this unusual year and also hope to have an opportunity to meet with you on one of our campuses soon. To the Grade 12 students, I hope that your year is beginning to feel more settled and structured as you move towards your year-end exams. I have no doubt that the pressure of this pandemic and the challenges in the school environment have been really tough for you to navigate. To all of the parents and family members supporting the 2020 Grade 12 students, we thank you for all that you have done to enable the class of 2020 to be best supported. At the IRE's Varsity College, we pride ourselves in the individual student support that we are able to offer to our students, and this year has tested our culture within the lockdown environment. I am proud of what we have managed to achieve, thanks to the agility and commitment of our academic and support staff. This morning, I'm delighted to have an opportunity to provide you with some more information about us. The IRE's Varsity College was founded 30 years ago, and open to students for the first time in 1991. Today, we proudly maintain the reputation of being at the forefront of private higher education in South Africa. Our student base is just over 19,000 students. Varsity College is an educational brand of the Independent Institute of Education, which is more frequently referred to as the IIE. The IIE is the largest and most accredited higher education provider in South Africa. With a student base of 45,000 students, they offer over 120 higher education qualifications currently. The IIE is registered with the Department of Higher Education and Training as a private higher education provider. The IIE is responsible for the assessment and certification of our students, developing curricula and overseeing its delivery thereof, and ensuring the correct teaching and learning processes are implemented and adhered to. There are six academic schools at Varsity College, and these are all aligned to the IIE's academic governance, structures, and disciplines. These are the schools of management, the school of law, the school of psychology and communication, the school of finance and accounting, the school of education, and the school of information technology. During our open day, you will have an opportunity to hear from and engage with our heads of school to find out more about the range of IIE qualifications that are offered within each of our schools. IIE degrees, diplomas and higher certificates are offered on our eight Varsity College campuses. Our campuses are located in Santon, Pretoria, Waterfall, Cape Town, Port Elizabeth, Durban North, Westville and Peter Maritzburg. I appreciate that students looking to embark on higher education studies next year have a range of both private and public institutions to consider. This process of evaluation is important one, as not only are you investing financially in your future, but you are also committing to the next few years of your life. We believe there are two important considerations that need to be evaluated in this process. 
The first being the career area that you believe you want to enter into. With this comes the importance of ensuring that your qualification choice will equip you not only with the best knowledge, but importantly, the best skills to enter into the marketplace with. Your qualification choice must be recognized by future employers or the industry in which you wish to partake. The second consideration is around ensuring that the institution itself can offer an environment in which you can both thrive academically and more broadly from a student experience point of view. We have geared our open day today around providing you with information on these two areas and have created opportunities for you to engage with us individually during your time today. As the world changes, so do the requirements of employers. Today's employers are looking for a new set of skills. In fact, the most sought after skills are critical thinking and problem solving, which is precisely what we focus on, as we know that these skills are what will help you as a graduate succeed in the new world. The way we teach is unique and is continuously adapted to ensure that our students are captivated and engaged with the aim of making students independent and self-directed learners. The Varsity College teaching philosophy of quality teaching for quality learning aims to make academic life as interesting and participative as possible. The most effective learning, we believe, stems from a dynamic two-way exchange. Our unique collaborative approach means active participation by our students, which builds understanding and develops critical thinking. The world is changing and we've adapted to ensure that our students are never left behind. Changes in the world of work have altered the way we approach our teaching. We've moved away from traditional lecture room teaching style towards what we call the VC blend, a teaching strategy where the lecturer is no longer the focus, rather the student is the centre of the learning process. With this approach, we take full advantage of the latest technological developments and innovations in taking our students' learning experience to the next level. With the understanding that a collective can go further together for the benefit of our students, the IIE's Varsity College has developed meaningful partnerships with both corporates and other education institutions. An example of such a partnership is the British Accreditation Council, which is an independently authority in the United Kingdom that accredits private providers globally. Since 2014, the IIE has had its accreditation status confirmed as the independent higher education institution. With this partnership, our students can be confident that their learning experience meets international best practice standards. We believe our graduate success stems from our progressive attitude to learning, our continuous investment in resources, and most importantly, the development of a personalized student support system for each student. While we are determined about our students' academic success, it is also very important to us that our students lead balanced, sport, social and community engaged lives. We are excited this year to launch our scholarship program. The goal of this scholarship initiative is to broaden access to private higher education and is based on academic merit. We have four categories of scholarship, namely Excellence Scholarship, which includes our Corporate Partnership Scholarships and Achiever and Rising Star Scholarships. I encourage each of you to visit our website to find out more about this opportunity and to please be mindful of our closing date on the 30th of September. I am sure that you have many questions and I hope that today will give you some insight into who we are and how we can best help you prepare for the new world. New world thinking. So earlier I touched on new world thinking. What do we mean when we say new world thinking? So at the IIE's Varsity College, we offer an environment where modern ways of teaching and learning go hand in hand. We equip each learner not only to survive, but also to thrive in the real world. The workplace, it's ever changing. Your qualification gets you in the door making coffee with Stephen from accounting. But skills such as critical thinking, problem solving and effective communication truly prepares the students for the challenges of the real working world, the actual boardroom, presentation, a company crisis perhaps. Employers want more than qualifications. They value effective teamwork, problem solving and functioning in a diverse work setting. Sure, the company is lucky to have you and your qualified self, but you're just adding to that value by being an employee who adapts 
an employee who not only has opinions on new problems, but solutions too. A new world is a dynamic and fluid working world where the best preparation is not only academic knowledge, but the ability to apply your mind. And that's why you're choosing Varsity College, because those are the type of molders we are here. That's what we're exposing you to. That's who, with determination and support, we are carefully carving you into. A new world thinker. Knowledge is everywhere. Information is being shared quicker than ever before. 5G is coming. One gigabyte per second is not science fiction anymore. Anyone can learn anywhere, at any time, at any age. Yesterday's way of working and learning just won't cut it anymore. What are you bringing to the table? At the IIE's Varsity College, we go beyond knowledge. We teach our students what to do with that knowledge. We teach students how to solve problems, to think critically and creatively. You will be an asset in the new world. So guys, one of the hardest things about transitioning from high school to varsity is not getting used to the new environment or getting used to new friends or new faces. No, I'll tell you what, one thing that is hard. It's finding dope new outfits to wear every day because uniform can't save you. There's no more ties and shirts and blazers anymore. It's your own home clothes every day at school. But don't panic yet, guys. You know, Varsity College has your back. Today, we're giving away three clothing vouchers worth 2,500 Rand from Superbalist. I know, excitement, excitement, you can get dope stuff on Superbalist. So I'm gonna go through the live chat right now and choose a random name because you guys have been chatting. I see your, I see your comments. I know you guys are chatting. Thank you so much for, for communicating with us. But I'm gonna choose a random name and see who gets the 2,500 Rand voucher from Superbalist. Are you guys ready? Okay. Let me see. I will choose drum roll. Please make an imaginary drum roll right now in your house. Um, our first winner is Keenan. Congratulations to you. Please email us at infoadversitycollege.co.za with your chat handle in the subject line so we can get your prize to you. Don't fear, guys. We still have two more vouchers to go. We still have two people who could get dope clothing from Superbalist. But I think I want to make the next two a bit more interesting. So the next voucher that I'm going to give away, you have to answer one simple question. How old is Varsity College turning this year? I'll give you a couple of, of, of hints, you know. Is it A, 20 years old, B, 16 years old, or C, 10 years old? I'll look through the live chat and you guys tell me how old is Varsity College turning this year? You heard me in the earlier saying, telling you when it was established. Tell me how old we are this year and you could win 2,500 Rand in clothing vouchers. Hit me up. You will now hear a little bit more about the schools of excellence from the various heads of schools. My name is Dominique Newpin and I'm the head of school of management for the IIE's Varsity College. Thank you so much for your time and attention today. I have the great pleasure of introducing the school of management to you. And while I wish we could be chatting in person, my team and I will be online to answer any questions that you may have in real time during this presentation. So while we were putting this presentation together, we wanted to make sure that we focus on the key aspects of what we are about as a school and how we serve and support our students. To this end, we thought that there would be three key areas that would be of most value to you as a starting point. Insight into what we're all about as a school, thoughts on why we believe in the value of a qualification in business, and key points around what makes us as a school the best place for you as a student. We'll have about 20 to 25 minutes together, so let's dive right in. So what is the School of Management all about? Well, before we even look at our people or our qualifications or our teaching and learning strategies, in a nutshell, we are all about our students. And all of our structures, our systems, qualifications, state-of-the-art online learning platform, beautiful campuses, highly skilled staff, all of these are geared towards looking after the interests of our students and towards providing the best tertiary experience. We are so pleased when students like Milali feel our supportive and personalized approach even before becoming an IIE Varsity College student. As she says, you can feel quite unprepared for life after high school and like you have to figure things out as you go, but with our team, she felt guided from the very beginning. This perfectly encapsulates what we are about. To provide an environment and tertiary experience which we are incredibly proud to be a part of, we have a team of highly successful and committed individuals, 
all focused solely on the success of our School of Management students and on supporting you to work towards your own career in business. Our national team is made up of myself as head of school and Shimola and Josima, our two deputy heads of schools, and uh, together we make up a national team which oversees the academic quality of your student journey, whether you're on one of our physical campuses or online. We then have a program manager at each of our campuses, again focusing exclusively on delivering the best quality academic journey to you. Key to this journey is ensuring that we have the best lecturers on your modules. And as you'll see, our students consistently identify the quality of the lecturing team as playing a key part in their success. The School of Management is multifaceted. We have over 6,800 students. We are the largest school in the IIE. We are well resourced and offer a wide selection of qualifications to support our students in mapping out the journey into the world of business. Whatever your current level of knowledge, your academic background, your future aspirations, we can offer you valued and respected qualifications that steadily develop your business acumen, your critical thinking, that provide you with the framework um, through which to map your journey through higher education and to scaffold your advancement through the School of Management. Depending on your chosen qualification, we also offer you options around how you study, be it full-time, part-time or online. The School of Management is represented by the largest academic management team. We have strong connections into industry through each campus's career center. And we also offer short learning programs, which offer you the opportunity to supplement your studies and also our testament to our commitment to a lifelong learning through being able to offer adults the option of continuing their studies and professional advancement with us. At this point, I'm sure that you are interested to hear more about our qualifications. At the School of Management, we actually offer the largest basket of qualifications at the IIE's Varsity College. We have six higher certificates, we have two diplomas, two bachelor's degrees with a range of core disciplines from which you can choose, and we have two postgraduate qualifications and honours and a postgraduate diploma in management. As you can see, we offer you a journey all the way through your studies. Our content, of course, speaks to market needs and graduate employability, and very importantly, all our qualifications are accredited by the Council on Higher Education, the CHE. They are registered with the South African Qualifications Authority, and they're based on the National Qualifications Framework. Our qualifications layer onto one another, so you can move seamlessly from a higher certificate to a degree to postgraduate studies. And we also interlink with other schools, so that, for example, you can move from one of our qualifications into some other qualifications in other schools, such as the School of Finance and Accounting, School of Law and School of Psychology and Communication. Through the recognition of higher certificate modules, we also actually offer you the opportunity to work towards a BCom degree while completing a higher certificate. In terms of our Bachelor of Commerce degree, we have four core disciplines that you can choose from in terms of your area of focus. You can choose between a focus on financial management, finance and accounting, marketing management or strategic management. And as you can see, the subject choices change depending on your chosen core discipline to provide you with a bachelor degree that focuses on the areas that are most relevant to your chosen career path. We also have a very exciting bachelor degree in entrepreneurship, a BCom in entrepreneurship, which is launching in 2021. And this was developed in collaboration with successful entrepreneurs who are really walking the talk, so to speak. When completing a School of Management qualification, it is of utmost importance to us that you are provided with relevant content and that you are provided with lecturers who are able to link theoretical knowledge and practical real-life application. And this is an area of focus that is consistently highlighted by our students as being a key point of difference that has set them up for success. We are a team on a mission, and we're on a mission to develop inquiring, adaptable citizens, to use skills facilitation and self-directed learning to make sure that you've acquired knowledge and skills and a sense of accountability that enables you to contribute to business in local economies and in global economies in the dynamic world in which we find ourselves. Feedback from our students such as Kiata as to how equipped she now feels to accomplish her goals and from Rashika on the value of active learning, the application of learning to daily life, fostering an interest in lifelong learning, all of these reflect the practical realization of the strategies underlying our school's mission and of course absolutely makes our day. We'll have a quick look at key practical strategies that we use to achieve our mission when we chat about why you should choose to study with the IIE's Varsity College School of Management. And I hope that you can see how our world revolves around our students. Typically, the students of the School of Management come to us because they want to make a difference in the world, uh, in their chosen field, they want to achieve success. 
They want to create businesses, contribute to the economy, create jobs. They're dynamic. They're independent thinkers. They want to meet others who are also working towards their future goals. And they want to enjoy the higher education journey. They want to be recognized as individuals and supported in a responsive way during their studies, especially in the climate that we currently find ourselves in. We have four video clips of current students that I would love to share with you now um, that gives you some insight into being a part of the School of Management student body. I am a third year BCom student studying at the Varsity College in Pretoria. I've learned so many skills throughout my time studying the BCom qualification. I have learned to think critically. I've learned to think creatively and I've learned the fundamentals of the business environment. I've learned to take the skills that I've learned in the classroom and apply them in real life situations. And it's also helped me with understanding concepts better in real life, such as current affairs that happen in South Africa, as well as globally. Well, hi there, my name is Apia Mijeni. I'm from East London. Started at Varsity College this year. I'm, uh, School of Management for me has been the perfect fit because it's sort of giving me the necessary dynamics and the type of work I want to do, which is coaching rugby at schools. And yeah, the teachers at the school are very helpful. It's, especially during this pandemic, I've been given the necessary assistance. And yeah, I'm hoping to get my, my diploma in the next three years and yeah, hopefully make a, a success of myself. Um, thank you. Hi, my name is Nancy Dolly. I'm currently a student at Varsity College Port Elizabeth in my third and final year of completing a Bachelor of Commerce degree in Finance and Accounting. Being a part of Varsity College's School of Management has definitely prepared me for the career path that lies ahead of me, knowing that each and every one of us have been equipped by only the best team of staff and lecturers who have gone the extra mile in ensuring that we are prepared to compete at global standards. Hey everyone, my life as a Varsity College student has been absolutely amazing. Varsity College has given me the tools both needed to thrive in the workplace and in the classroom. They've taken such great care of me and I've made friends that are going to be with me for life in Varsity College. I would highly recommend Varsity College because they have staff and lecturers who genuinely care about me and they're genuinely worried about what I was doing. They ensured that I had everything I needed to be successful in my studies and outside of school. I always had the most intensive care looking after me and ensuring that I was progressing through and the friendliest lecturers and staff to make sure that I always had what I needed. Varsity College has left me with friends for life and I've made sure that I have memories to tell my kids and my grandkids. I've had the best time at Varsity College and I'd highly recommend it to anybody. I hope you guys enjoy your time. So who are the lecturers facilitating this level of experience for our students? Well, our lecturers are the cornerstone of the school. They are highly skilled in bridging what is often a divide between theoretical concepts and real-world application. They are highly skilled in blended learning, so we can bring you the best learning experience regardless of lockdown regulations. We also have a, a few video clips from some of our lecturers, which I'd also love to share with you, about how they support our students' higher education journey. Hi all, I'm Katie Robert. I'm the Acting Program Manager for the School of Management at the IAE's Varsity College Sanson campus. I am also a lecturer on the Diploma in Sport Development Management, and I lecture across all three years. For me, teaching, lecturing is a passion. It is a calling. It's not just a job. My students are extremely important to me. Student support is extremely important to me. And it's not just about the module content. It is about creating a well-rounded, high work ethic citizen to go out into the world. This is why I use extremely practical examples in my class, trying to bring world of work into the classroom. Um, I get my students to participate in real life sporting events. We did the Southern Gauteng Hockey Masters last year, where not only did they get to live out their event management, but they also got to see the coaching side as well as the management of teams. This is obviously top education for them and they are well equipped when they do eventually leave us with the qualification. That's specific to the DSDMs. However, as the School of Management, we strive to have this across all of our qualifications. 
My name is Katod Lamini, Junior Lecturer under the School of Finance and Accounting, lecturing under the School of Management. It is our belief that students need a sense of the real world during the course of their studies, which is why teaching with real world examples attached is a norm in our lecture rooms. Our students are not only taught how things work, but are challenged to why this is the case. This is later tested with unexpected scenario activities to not only prepare them for the exams, but to prepare them for life. Our goal is for them to step out with a greater desire to learn more. Here in the School of Management, we strive to make our students aware of the different backgrounds that we have in society. With this in mind, we invoke this into our learning so that we can make them conscious and accountable citizens of both the lecturing space and the real world of work. We focus on theory-based concepts with the addition of examples so that we can make them into creative and innovative thinkers for the real world problems that they will face. Hi, my name is JC. I'm the Deputy Head of School for the School of Management, a proud alumni of the IIE's Varsity College, and I lecture finance and business management. What I enjoy most about lecturing is our small classroom sizes and our dynamic material. This allows us to tackle difficult concepts whilst having fun in the classroom and maintaining lifelong relationships. The most valuable part of my job is to watch my students graduate and become successful businessmen and women. Students like Leo and Rashika again show us the extent to which our focus on a quality lecturing team is delivering a quality academic experience. As we head towards the end of this section, you may be wanting to know more about the skills that you'll be developing and that our students keep on referring to. Well, in terms of the content of your qualification, you will have many exciting modules that will form part of your, of your chosen qualification. These subjects could include management, leadership, entrepreneurship, sports development, event management, information and knowledge management, work integrated learning. However, because we prepare you for a career in business, we also focus on what are known as soft skills, your communication skills, collaboration, ethics, critical thinking. We are committed to developing you as the individual that you are. And by working with the Career Centre and BCKs on your campus, we provide ongoing opportunities for you to develop skills that support your learning and your ability to step into the workplace and into life with confidence. And we want you to have fun. As Chanel points out, we encourage a balance between academics and a well-rounded social life. As you saw in our student recordings, here is where you make friends for life. And you have those experiences that you tell your children and your grandchildren about, and we want you to enjoy every moment. So understanding all of this about the School of Management, why should you consider a qualification in business and becoming a part of our student body? Well, first off, there's an increasing demand for people with entrepreneurial skills, with financial acumen, with the ability to analyze business performance, work with people in teams, align people towards a common goal, and deliver business results through skilled management and leadership. This is evident in our employment stats. Of our past students surveyed in 2020, 71.71% were employed within six months of completing their qualification, and 20% actually already had accepted employment before they even completed their studies. The field of business is really a dynamic one. It covers an incredibly diverse number of opportunities from entrepreneurship to logistics to retail, analyzing and managing the financial performance of a business, marketing, project management, strategy. Studies in business and management can be the stepping stone towards a career in any of these directions. You can choose to approach your large, well-known corporates, such as those reflected on this slide that have employed a large percentage of our graduates. You can choose to look at small to medium businesses or even at starting your own business. A business qualification also gives you the opportunity to start with a broad focus, to identify where your passion lies and what you're really interested in, and then to become more specialized and follow your passion. Importantly, the skills that our qualifications provide will equip you to follow a career in any number of disciplines. So from engineers to entrepreneurs, 
the ability to plan, organize, sell, lead, manage yourself, manage others. These are all invaluable in any profession and even in your daily personal life. When you look at the job opportunities available to our individual qualifications, you'll see, for example, on our higher certificates that each has a business base, a business as a foundation, and then subjects that focus in on each specific discipline. So subjects specific to event management, to business principles and practices, bookkeeping, office administration, logistics and supply chain management and human resources. And the job opportunities that are opened up to you once you've completed your higher certificate are generally aligned to this focus, although you can also look at positions that have a more general administrative support focus. Our Diploma in Sport, which is known as our DSTM, this is for those of you focused on moving into a more sports and management oriented field. And then our DCBM is a more general commerce and management focus, and this is only offered on our Port Elizabeth campus. For our BCom students, you're looking at general management and related roles, but you're also looking at roles that are more specific to your chosen core discipline, whether you've uh, chosen to look uh, more specifically at marketing, at strategy, or at finance. Our BCom also lays the foundation for further studies and provides you with the opportunity to articulate into our BCom honors and our postgraduate PG DIP qualifications. Our BCom in entrepreneurship paves the way for you to take up general management and related roles too. Again, also in smaller or more corporate businesses. However, because the qualification has got modules developed specifically for entrepreneurial knowledge and skills, it is also geared towards helping you follow a more entrepreneurial path if that is what you are interested in doing. Our postgraduate qualif qualifications will further develop and hone your skills and open up further opportunities for advancement in your field. And they leave the door open to a master's uh, studies if you find that you are unable to leave the academic path. So... From our host of qualifications, we suggest that you select one that aligns and prepares you for the career that you want. And then importantly, that you take action to develop your skills and move towards your future vision. Take advantage of the opportunities that we provide to you and we are there with you every step of the way. As we head into the final section of this presentation, we wanted to just take a few minutes to look at why you should not only consider a business qualification, but why you should choose to complete their qualification with the IIE's Varsity College School of Management. As you've seen in, in the testimonials in this presentation, we believe in actively asking our students for feedback and continuing to understand how best to support and add value. The points identified on this slide come from our graduate survey, and many of them have already been mentioned by the testimonials uh, today. What I wanted to do was just select a few that possibly haven't been mentioned yet uh, just given the time that we have together. So our graduates highlighted that we have a safe environment with no strike action into interrupting their studies. We have small class sizes and technology. We have technology that supports you with learning in the class and outside the class. Uh, they identified the individual attention that they receive and the constant support that we provide. These are qualities that you'll find across the IIE's Varsity College. Specifically to the School of Management, we are the largest school within the IIE's Varsity College. We are well-resourced. We offer you the largest basket of qualifications. We map your journey from higher certificate right through to postgraduate studies. We offer you flexibility in how you study and the opportunity to be part of a school that has skilled academic representation on each and every IIE's Varsity College campus, as well as at national level. We have simulated work integrated learning modules which facilitate your journey into the world of business by further cementing the connection between your theoretical knowledge and your practical application of what you're learning. We have partnered with institutions such as Elevate who specialize in specific skills that students require to succeed such as time management and learning strategies and we focus on proactive tracking of student performance and tailored initiatives we look at how are our students doing on each and every campus and which modules require specific support. And we provide interventions such as our numeracy tutorial sessions specifically geared to support you in those more tricky numeracy modules. Importantly, our ultimate goal is to prepare you for a career in business and to provide you with the skills that can be used across disciplines and in your personal life. To that end, we work closely with the Career Centre on every campus to not only identify employment opportunities, but also to focus in on specific skills that you will need. These include developing your CV, securing your, your interviews and acing your interviews. In terms of some of the practical strategies that you will encounter in your lectures as we prepare you for the world of work, you can expect to be learning and applying your knowledge. 
You can expect to be sharing the responsibility for your journey, taking part in presentations, debates, studying with peers. It's so important, such a valuable part of your learning experience. You'll expect to be collaborating, problem solving and researching. We provide you with the opportunity to network, to develop your leadership skills and take part in work readiness programs. And we highly, highly recommend that you grab hold of these opportunities and work with us to make sure that you are work ready. These strategies are underpinned by cutting edge approaches to teaching and learning. And we have just a short clip to share with you that will provide you with more insight into our teaching and learning strategies before our presentation draws to a close. brings our time together to an end. I thank you again for your time and attention and we hope to see you soon. Bye for now. Hi, my name is Serena and I have the pleasure of running the School of Information Technology for Varsity College. We are a small school but we're growing really fast. I believe this is because we offer qualifications that are not only industry relevant, but fun for students to study. The school currently offers qualifications ranging from certificates all the way through to degrees. We are currently working on our master's degree and we will be launching our honours qualifications soon. The qualifications currently in our basket is a higher certificate in information technology and support services aimed at students who hope to be service desk technicians. We also offer a very practical diploma in information technology and software development aimed at students who want to hit the development world running. We offer a Bachelor of Computer and Information Sciences in Network Engineering, which is a unique qualification aimed at students who want to administrate enterprise networks. We also offer a Bachelor of Computer and Information Sciences in Application Development, which is a beautiful blend between the theoretical knowledge and the practical skills you need to be a really good software developer. The Bachelor of Information and Computer Sciences and Application Development is unique in the way that it offers students a well-rounded experience. So if you are a student who doesn't really enjoy development, but you enjoy technology, this qualification will enable you to enter realms such as project management and IT management. But if you are a student who really enjoys code and is really looking into a developer, we offer a wide range of programming languages and we have a really practical approach. We work from Java to C Sharp, from SQL to NoSQL with databases such as Mongo and Firebase. We introduce Java frameworks such as Angular. We have really fun mobile development with Android. If you further enjoy diagramming and planning of software, we also um, introduce modules such as system development and design, which will allow you to be the architect that plans software. The qualification in network engineering follows the same rules. We take the time to teach you the theoretical underpinnings of infrastructure planning and design so that you can develop networks that are actually usable and suitable for your client base. We then give you the practical punch of introducing Microsoft Server, various Linux distros, cloud platforms such as Azure and VMware, a really good understanding of how wireless networking works, the technologies we use there. And then we also introduce a wide range of data database management platforms. And this is only to name a few of the really exciting modules that you will do in these qualifications. IT is for everyone. It is not true that IT is aimed at mathematical geniuses or tech kids. Actually, IT is a hugely creative profession. 
because it employs us to solve problems every day. You have to think out the box and you have to use the tools that you are given, whether it is code or whether it is stringing technologies together or bringing up a server to solve current problems of the world, business, NGOs, you name it. I have one student that was a part of this process who would probably like to share a bit more. So in 2016, I uh, decided to make quite a drastic career change from being a dive instructor for nearly uh, 10 years to the IT industry. Um, as you can imagine, I uh, lacked the confidence because I hadn't studied in it so long. Um, so I chose Varsity College because of their promise of smaller classes and um, more personalized attention. Um, so that could help me through the process. And yeah, three years later, um, uh, I thrived in the environment and I managed to land a really nice uh, junior software development job. Um, that helped me throughout the entire process. I was able to work uh, afternoons or mornings, depending when my lectures were, on, in which year. And um, actually I was even managed to work for Varsity College as a tutor. After it was all done, they had quite a strong um, career platform, which helped me find the job of my dreams in my house and my pajamas. <laughs> we are very picky about the lecturers we hire, and we have good reason for this. We want lecturers who have good academic qualifications, as well as really good industry experience. We want lecturers to remember their very first day in industry. And they will most often tell you that theory alone is not enough. To be successful in the IT industry, you need a really good theoretical underpinning, but you absolutely need the practical skills to actually do your job. And more than that, you need to be an independent thinker. We push independence and self-directed learning into everything we do. We start by introducing the four C's, which is known as creativity, communication, collaboration, and critical thinking. We want students who can solve problems. We then overlay this with blended learning that asks students to work by themselves independently of their lecturer. And in our classrooms, we implement problem-based learning where we pose students a problem and we actually give them the opportunity to solve the problem. That does not mean that we just leave students flousing about, no students teach themselves, but we guide students towards finding the information and the solution themselves in the hope that we equip them for an ever-changing, fast-paced IT industry. Further to this, anybody can spin up a server and anybody can write code. It's highly unlikely that anybody can do it well. We give you the theoretical underpinnings with modules such as programming logic and design, and we overlay that with the practical skill. Programming logic and design will teach you what good code looks like, how good loops run, how we structure software and put it together. And in Java or C Sharp or Android, we allow you to apply that knowledge and we give you the practical skills of working with relevant IDEs and programming languages practically. The same is true in networking. We teach you domains and we teach you directory services and all of the theory and concepts around them so that when you use products like Microsoft Active Directory or you use directory services in a Linux distro such as Red Hat and Leap, you really understand what you are doing and you provide a good solid product. And we give you Leap and we give you Microsoft Server so that you can practically do your job. Noisy classrooms are effective classrooms. You can literally hear students learning. We prefer noisy classrooms where students are actively learning, grappling with content, searching the internet, debating with each other whether the solution is sound and implementing it, even if that means your classroom is sometimes a complete loop. The IT industry is ever-changing and it is fast-paced and we need to deliver employable students but also students who can survive the really undergoing like vine of this industry of change, 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 and constant change. And we can only do this if we produce a robust and resilient student. One of them that can think critically and students who can apply their knowledge over a wide range of technologies. 
And what that means is it's highly unlikely that you're going to work in the technology that you are trained in. So you did Java for three years and you are a Java developer for three months in industry. And your boss comes to you and he says, well, we've considered our options and we're changing to Python. I should deliver a student who knows that there is 75% of Java that's also in Python and that is able to translate that thinking over and who knows how to find the bits that are different, learn them and apply them. I can only do this if I teach them how to find the bits that are different. So I have to provide students with opportunities to construct their own knowledge and I have to model the skills and characteristics and behaviours of our discipline. These behaviours can be taught if we teach students the principles of good practice regardless of technology use. So whether you are coding in Python, Java, Angular, Rust, Ruby, Go, the principles of good practice remains. Whether you are setting up a network for a small school with one server or you are heading to Microsoft, the same principles remain. I need to teach you the skills to look for and find, evaluate and apply good information. I can't be next to you forever. I need to know that when you are at work, and your boss gives you a new project that you have never seen before, you know where to find the information, to evaluate the information if it is sound, and how to apply that information into your solution. I need to give you the ability to find solutions to problems. I need you to teach your knowledge or to apply your knowledge over a wide range of solutions and circumstances so that the changes and shifts in the IT industry doesn't phase you at all. So you should be looking at a slide right now that says, when you start working as a programmer, you Google how to get the date in C++. And you sometimes do the same thing 10 times later or 10 years later. So Google or search engines is the index cards of our industry. And I need to get you really comfortable to use this index cards really, really well. So we use quite a bit of Google in our classrooms. We will typically solve you, give you a problem and say, I've had a customer come to me they're looking for a tax calculator and I need you to provide it and I need you to find the code on the internet and you and I will grapple together until we find a good and strong solution and you learn the skills that you need. You are able to find and apply information, solve the problem and to move forward. The IT industry also translates a lot of business industries and students even need to survive this change. So a student who is currently administrating a network for architecture and engineering firms, needs to be able to move over to medical and health um, firms very easily and apply his knowledge there. The same for a student that is currently coding up timestamps for a warehousing and logistics company, he should be able to translate his knowledge into e-commerce sites for sales and marketing. And we need to use problem-based learning and to teach our students the skills of finding the solutions to these problems so that they can survive these industry shifts. Technology is important to us. And we believe that students should be taught industry-relevant technology. There is an argument in education and sometimes often the IT industry, but the principles remain the same regardless of the technology we are using. This is true. But it does not mean that we have to teach outdated technology. So we introduce the you know, elegant programming languages such as Java and C Sharp. We spend time on submitting. But we also pack in what industry is after, what dev houses are looking for on a CV, and the technology that software is actually being produced in today. So we introduced NoSQL databases like Firebase and Mongo, governance frameworks like COVID and ITIL. We honor the giants such as Oracle and SQL. But we also push for AWS and Google. We want Node.js, we want Azure. We want Linux distros from Red Hat to Puppy. We want students to be able to enter the industry with the tools of our trade and with the current tool of our trade. We have worked with some lovely partners. And the people you see on your screen right now have hired from us continuously. The line as an educator that I always like to hear from these in industries and that I thrive on is that our students cope well, that they enter this industry with the theoretical knowledge to truly understand what they are implementing, but also with the practical skills to actually implement it 
which very often shortens the time they spent in graduate internships or readiness programs. We want to provide students who can hit the ground running. We want developers who can enter the industry as developers and network administrators who can enter the industry as network administrators and engineers. We want students who are able to go into the industry and offer value from day one. I have one lecturer who currently works for such an industry and also lectures for us who would like to elaborate a little bit more. Hi, I'm currently a part-time lecturer at Varsity College. I also work for a major software development company in Durban called Tecama Solutions. With over 25 years of IT industry experience, I saw lecturing as a good way to give back my many years experience to the students. And I'm not alone. In fact, this is what gives Varsity College its edge in that it uses lecturers from industry. This strong and continual connection with industry ensures that Varsity College students are giving practical, relevant and real world knowledge which in the IT industry is gold. And finally, I hope that every student that enters this industry leaves it with a love of technology, leaves it with an honor for our discipline that will see them through the days in industry, which can be dark, the days when your code is broken, nothing will join your domain, it's three minutes to deadline and you're panicking, the days where you wonder why you entered this field and why you took this job. I'm hoping to impart on you a love for technology that will see you through those days, as well as a love for technology that will make you want to always learn more, always upskill, always join the latest trend, fiddle with everything that is new. I also hope to teach you a love for our discipline that makes you honor it, that makes it honor you honor the rules of our discipline, which is solve problems, code well, plan properly, produce quality be ethical. Thank you very much for your time. And I hope to see you in my classroom soon so you can join our noisy zoo. Just a reminder that we do have student advisors on standby who are ready to tell you more about our eight state-of-the-art campuses located across the country, our six academic schools of excellence, and countless social and sports clubs you can be a part of. Also take this opportunity to absorb some advice and wisdom don't be nervous about not knowing 100% what you want to do. What are your dreams, abilities, and passions? Let's discuss this and help you choose your qualification based on these. Once you choose your qualification, you'll know what results to achieve. The student advisors will also chat to you about fees, financing, and how you may qualify for a bursary. My favorite thing about studying at Varsity College Pretoria is that I made people like me. You are bound to just fit in. It feels like you're within family. The classes at Varsity College are very small. You feel like you get more attention. We get more interaction with our lecturer. I have interesting lecturers, I must say. They put in effort when it comes to teaching us. They want to make sure that you understand what you're doing. We have four computer labs. The VC portal is where you see your school marks, your modules. We have the library. It's an environment where you can go to do your schoolwork. At Varsity College, there's a great balance between work and play. The cafe is where everyone can hang out. You can have your food, you can play some pool. We have the outdoor areas. It's under trees with picnic tables. I'm in the SRB and I'm the head of social. As soon as I know it's a Wednesday, it's Meridian hour, it's my playtime. I have to make sure students are having fun. The career center is where students can find part-time jobs and it gives you experience. VC Cares is our charity work. They tell us what we need to gather, what money we need to raise for charities. The sports we have at Varsity College is so many. There's soccer and netball. We have a sports event called InterVarsity where all the Varsity Colleges come together. In Pretoria, we have the nature reserve. Every restaurant you can ask for and nightclubs. When you leave high school, you're going through tertiary phase. You want to grow, and at Varsity College, you grow quickly. Varsity College is an educational brand of the Independent Institute of Education, the IIE. Don't forget, IIE degree application closing date is on the 13th of November. Just a reminder that registration opens from the 7th of December. All relevant forms for application and registration can be found on our website.
My experience of studying at the IIE Varsity College Waterfall has been amazing. I love the fact that our campus is small, so I get to express myself and be comfortable. Our classroom structure is very small. The group discussions that we have are helpful. A lot of our lecturers have experience in the industry. We have discussions about what's happening in the world around us. We've been given the tools to help us with our education, such as free Wi-Fi. We also have computer rooms. You can access the VC portal to check all your modules. We have study labs on our campus where you can do your homework. We have a career center on campus which helps place you into different jobs depending on what you're studying. We have a variety of sports on our campus. We have golf, mountain biking, running club, hockey, soccer. BC Cares is a community outreach program. We collect perishable goods and clothing. We have shave a You can get involved by speaking to the committee. There's a good balance between social life and studies. Most of our socializing takes place on campus through the social committee. Students hang out at the cafeteria or the courtyard. Varsity College Waterfall is up the road from the Mall of Africa. We like going out to eat and going for coffee. Varsity College is a great institution to study with and you can always ask for help if you do need it. Varsity College is a brand of the Independent Institute of Education, the IIE. I bring you even more exciting news. We have a newly launched academic scholarship campaign for academically high achieving learners. We have four scholarship categories that are available for 2021 prospective students to consider and apply for should they meet the scholarship criteria. All information about the scholarships can be found on varsitycollege.co.za or alternatively, ask your student advisor who you can book an appointment with using the live chat feature. Joburg is different. We never slow down. We always want to do more. We always want to be more. Studying at Varsity College Santon has been a great experience. Our classes are kept small because of the interactive learning it creates and the relationship it tends to build between you and your lecturer. We have professionals that are lecturing in their part-time. It's really great because we get personal experience from them. We have six computer rooms. Our student portal is where we submit assignments. We have free Wi-Fi, so we encourage to browse the net for whatever information we may need for assignments. In Johannesburg, there's lots of social vibes. There's neighbor goods market where lots of students get together. The Career Centre does post part-time jobs and internships, and it basically gives us a head start in the working environment. The balance between work and play on the Santon campus is actually really good. We do have quite a few sports. The main one is soccer. Other than that, we have Action Nepal, Action Cricket, the SLB, they promote events. VC Cares is our community outreach program. It's a very enjoyable area to study in. It creates an atmosphere of professionalism here. Varsity College is an educational brand of the Independent Institute of Education, the IIE. As I mentioned before, here at the IIE's Varsity College, we promote a balanced student life between academics, sports and social aspects. If you wish to learn about the student events and sports clubs, please refer to the links on screen right now. I'm Lenny Thompson and I'm the head of School of Psychology and Communication at the IE Varsity College. When you study psychology and communication, you gain to have the most doors open to you. What makes the School of Psychology and Communication stand out is having a small class because when people share their experiences, they have a better understanding of how the world works. So the skills that you can gain are analytical skills, writing skills, empathy. It sounds like a soft skill, but it's a very important skill. Some of the career opportunities are journalism, social services, advertising, United Nations could be a career option. It also allows you to engage with social issues. We ask a lot of why and there's a lot of critical thinking and reasoning and understanding. There is no industry where understanding people relations is not going to be beneficial.
Welcome to the School of Psychology and Communication. My name is Dr. Lynette Thompson and my background is in education, English literature and psychology. My PhD is in psychology. I oversee all eight campuses nationally. So what can you expect in today's presentation? Today we will cover the following topics, the accreditation of our programs, the qualifications which we offer in our school, our student profile, our lecturer profile, the teaching and learning strategy that we employ at Varsity College, our support systems, the skills that you will acquire along the way, and some of the career pathways that are available to you. So all our qualifications are accredited by the Council on Higher Education, CHE, and registered by the South African Qualifications Framework, also known as SACWA. The qualifications we offer in our school are as follows. We have the highest certificate in communication practices, which we will offer for the first time in 2021. We have the Bachelor of Arts degree, which is a general degree. We have a slightly more specialized degree called the Bachelor of Arts in Corporate Communication. We then have our first postgraduate offering, which is called the Bachelor of Arts Honours in Communication. And our new postgraduate offering that we started for the first time in 2020, called the Bachelor of Arts Honours in Psychology. Some of the modules that you can expect to cover include English language practices, communication science, applied communication techniques, fundamentals of media studies, design thinking and problem solving, digital and academic literacies, and you'll do a component on work integrated learning. The next qualification that we offer is called the Bachelor of Arts degree. This is our generalist degree. The BA degree is a general arts degree that focuses on the art of learning and critical thinking. The degree provides students with a choice of two of the following three disciplines, a combination of English and communication science, or a combination of English and psychology, or a combination of communication science and psychology. Graduates of a BA degree will qualify to work in a variety of sectors and organizations in both the public and private spheres. The Bachelor of Arts degree is aimed at students who are keen to study a broad-based degree focusing on communication science, psychology, and or English. It is a degree that allows students the opportunity to engage with various subject areas initially and then make a decision at the end of their first year about which path to take. The modules included in this qualification are communication science, English literature, psychology, sociology, media law and ethics, journalism, media studies, and research in the third year. The next Bachelor of Arts degree is a slightly more specialized degree and is called the Bachelor of Arts in Corporate Communication. The BACC degree offers students a learning experience in the communication field. Students gain a grounding in the key disciplines of corporate communication, communication science, and business management. They are equipped with theoretical knowledge, strong problem solving, critical thinking, and strategic skills. And these skills are linked to communication at both an individual and society level in a socially responsible and creative way. So who is this degree aimed at? This degree will appeal to you if you are a creative thinker who enjoys social interaction and using communication as a key means to achieve goals. If you're keen to use your skills within the business environment and you find the idea of being able to assist an organization look at new strategic ways to improve communication with their stakeholders so that they can reach their business objectives in an ethical and socially responsible manner, then this is the degree for you. Some of the modules in this degree include applied communication techniques, business management, communication science, corporate communication, marketing communication, media studies, as well as research in the third year. Our next qualification is, as I've mentioned before, our first postgraduate offering in the School of Psychology and Communication. It is called the Bachelor of Arts Honours in Communication. The Bachelor of Arts Honours in Communication is a qualification that enables students the opportunity to acquire advanced skills, competencies and knowledge in communication practice. 
the command of communication enables graduates to become communication professionals who are equipped to deal with evolving challenges in the global, cultural, political and business environments. Communication is the driving force for innovation and progress and sound leadership skills. This degree will appeal to you if you have an interest in furthering your knowledge in the communication field. Some of the modules you can expect to cover are communication theory, strategic organizational and leadership skills, critical skills, contemporary communication practices, research, which also includes writing a research report. The next postgraduate offering we have in our school is our newest edition and a very popular one called the Bachelor of Arts Honours in Psychology. The BA Arts in Psychology is designed to develop high level skills in the field of psychology. These skills include measurement skills, environmental awareness, interpersonal awareness, problem solving skills, critical evaluation, perspectives, higher order analysis, and problem solving skills. These skills all promote employability. This qualification is designed to academically prepare students for potential admission into further qualifications, such as the clinical psychology master's program or a counseling psychology master's program or master's in educational psychology. But please note that these qualifications all require further studies. The Bachelor of Arts Honours in Psychology is aimed at graduate students with an interest in furthering their knowledge in the field of psychology. This qualification is designed to deepen the student's expertise in the four core fields within psychology, namely psychopathology, therapeutic interventions, psychological assessment, and clinical psychology. So what are some of the modules in this qualification? They include psychological assessment, psychopathology, therapeutic interventions, development psychology or community psychology as these are electives and as well as research. Please note that the research in this course includes writing a research report. So I could tell you about our students, but I think it's best that you hear from them. Hi, my name is Steph and I'm a student at BC Westville campus and I'm currently studying my honors in psychology. What I love the most about studying through VC is the fact that the staff take a very personal interest in our lives and our education. They're always wanting to support us and help and motivate and encourage us to be the best versions of ourselves, as well as provide the best possible education experience they can. What I love about studying this degree through VC is the fact that our lecturers have such real life experience and they provide us with very practical examples of difficult concepts that we may be learning. They also provide a bit of insight into what it what it may look like to be a psychologist. This degree has not only broadened my knowledge of psychology, but it's also helped me grow as an individual. It's helped me learn more about myself and the others around me, and the fact that everybody has their own story and everyone's taken their own different paths to get to where they are today. When challenging times have come up, the lecturers are always there to help us and support us and to get over those challenges, and they also go one step further and they help us learn from those experiences. I've loved every minute of studying through this honours program through VC. It's been a very rewarding process and I've enjoyed it so much. Greetings, I'm Christy Bivenga, first year class representative and Bachelor of Arts student at Varsity College in Port Elizabeth School of Psychology and Communication. Coming from Namibia and only moving to South Africa this year, I am so thankful that I chose Varsity College. Not only is it very intimate, but it's also very diverse, especially looking at the academic side. We are covering various areas and I find that the information is very relevant. In fact, looking at how students are being taught and the different ways, I do find information can easily be absorbed and really sink in. In fact, students can interact very easily because the online platforms are also fantastic. Of course, we are now in lockdown period, but this has just proven that Varsity College is really on the ball and always a step ahead. 
they know exactly what students need and try to make the load lighter. Now, studying communication, I find that the communication at Varsity College, it's really a mind-blowing experience. It's like a family and resources available to students are just fantastic. Everything is really at your fingertips. Now, in my own life, I've had some challenges, but I must say that studying psychology and communication has taught me a lot about myself and how to deal with certain issues in my life. You will not only be enriched academically, but also as a person, you will grow a lot. And I am really looking forward to my journey in the future with Varsity College. Thank you so much for making me feel at home and for making me a better person. All of the best. Here are some of the testimonials that our lecturers have to share with you. Hi, my name is George Nock and I'm a proud lecturer at Varsity College. I come with the business environment. I've been a public relations manager for a very big bank for a very, very long time. So I come to Varsity College with a lot of practical knowledge and to actually impart it on the students is absolutely fascinating because I can teach them the real, how would you act in a real life situation? And I think that's the benefit of being a lecturer at Varsity College. They are all business, coming from business. And I, I enjoy the students, they are fantastic. It's a very good place to be at. Hi, good day. My name is Karika Young and I am a psychology lecturer at Varsity College in Port Elizabeth. I started my career with Varsity College in January 2019 um, while working at various different other kind of disability institutes but definitely realized very soon that this is a place where I want to grow and create a meaningful career. Um, the reason why I love it so much working here is first of all your caliber of learners. Um, the learners want to be here, they are eager to learn, um, they are proud. They form this awesome little family. Um, yes, families irritate each other and they have debates, but you know, they will do everything to protect themselves. I mean, these guys are coming from all walks of life, from all beautiful different skin colors. And when they hear, they just all work together. Um, I always feel like it's, it's this own little bubble you walk into and it's the perfect picture of what South Africa really can be. So I really love that. The other thing what I love about VC is the care part of it, the support. Um, besides the learners having tremendous amount of support, I mean, they have various different specific departments just focusing on them, on site um, counselors, everything for any kind of support for them, where they also do get involved with communities, but also the support, I think, for us, the lecturers. I mean, if we don't get the support, we can definitely not give them any kind of support and we'll just absolutely go crazy. So um, as a support, what we are getting, we've got our various different managers and program managers. Um, we've got our teaching and learning specialists that give you guidance. Um, if you just get stuck and you need some new creative way of trying to explain a concept, they are always there for you. And then your fellow staff members, there's no big competitive like a thing between the staff. It's really just very compassionate, caring, and wanting to help you, wanting to go like, oh, you know, try this idea, or I done that model last year, so I've got extra you know, slides for you. <laughs> it's gonna help you, so I will share it with you. So that I really love, because it's very, very rare that you find a working environment that is so caring. So that's why working at VC is absolutely fantastic, and I enjoy every moment of it and the awesome challenges and fun that we have here. What follows now is a short animated clip on our teaching and learning strategy at Varsity College and it includes some idea of our support systems.
having listening to what our students have to say, as well as our lecturers, what are some of the skills that you will acquire along the way, as well as completion of your qualification? The core skills that you will acquire as a student in our school are critical thinking, reading and writing skills. In addition to these skills, you will learn presentation skills as well as research skills, as well as capabilities of working individually and as part of a team. Now, this brings us to some of the career pathways that will be available to you. There are many, many career opportunities available to a student in the School of Psychology. These are really varied. And as I mentioned before, they range from public sector to private sector. The range is endless. And some of the careers that will be available to you are probably not even around right now, but definitely in the future. Some of the career pathways available to you include relationship and communication management, social media consulting, research, lecturing, script writing, media analysis, journalism, editing, scribing, community work, human resources, marketing, advertising, event management, corporate communication, public relations, media liaison, and communication strategy. Also note that the career option of teaching and counseling is also available, but that both these professions require further studies. So why should you join the School of Psychology and Education? Because as a student of our school, you will become a thought leader driving change through thinking, writing, critiquing, and research. We acknowledge that there is not only one version of things or events. We question, we interrogate, and we challenge. Thus, we direct our thinking to bring about change in our local, societal, and global communities. I would like to thank you for listening to our presentation, and you now have the opportunity to ask any questions. Think about it. The world's largest hotel chain doesn't own any property, and the biggest taxi company has no cars. The only way to thrive in this topsy-turvy world is to ask the right questions. Will the institution you study at model you for the past or prepare you for the future? Think about it, because at the IIE's Varsity College, that's what we do every day. Why is the sky blue? How do fish breathe underwater? Are that shadows made of? Why can't I see my eyes? But why can't we change that? Men of the team change their minds. At the IIE's Varsity College, our students are ready for the new world. So guys, I'm going through the live chat right now and something amazing is happening. All of you guys are just sharing your information and details and cell phone numbers because all you guys want to create groups. People are like, hey, add me to the PTA WhatsApp group. Hey, add me to the KZN WhatsApp group. I think it's so dope that you guys are already communicating, ready to get to know each other. It's going to be make it so easy to make friends already this year so that next year you already know, hey, it's me from the WhatsApp chat. You good? Anyway, guys, keep continuing chatting talk to each other and get to know each other because next year you guys are probably going to need each other you're going to be friends so guys i have one thing i i, I have to reveal one thing i had i propped up a, a question earlier right about the second voucher 
And I gave you some examples, like some, some answers you could answer about which is the correct answer of when was Varsity College founded and how old is Varsity College turning this year. I, I gave you three options and I have to confess something. I gave you trick options. And for the people who are really paying attention, you notice that. So it wasn't 20 or 16 or 17 years like I gave you the options. It was actually Varsity College was founded in 1991, making it... 29 this year and there's one of you well, two or three actually who got this correct and one of my favorite answers is from wade andrews let me read his exact answer actually he says you see the place was founded in 1991 mathematics baba it's 29 years congratulations to you wade you got the trick uh answer and you're winning 2500 rands worth of clothing vouchers from superbalist that's a keen eye. That's new world thinking. Keen eye. You know, you, you're paying attention. You're paying attention. So just hit us up with info at varsitycollege.co.za and you will get your prize as soon as possible. Keenan was so excited to get his prize. He even emailed me personally. He didn't even email Varsity College. He went to go find my email personally and said, hey, I won the, the, uh, the, the prize. Where is my prize? Don't worry, Keenan. I hope you're still on here. But don't worry. Just email Varsity College and you will get your present. Guys, don't worry. There's still one more voucher to give away for amazing clothing that you guys can wear. So don't worry. And there's still more prizes to go. And I have a special surprise for you guys because I see a lot of you guys are asking questions in the group. Who say, hey, well, I want, who, who, who can answer this question for me? Don't worry. We've got real students who are actually at Varsity College this year who can answer even more of your questions. Stay tuned for that a little bit later. But like I said, Bursaries are still up for grabs and another superbulous voucher for dope drip that you can wear. Don't worry about that, guys. Anyway, like I said, in email info at varsitycollege.co.za and you should get your prize. Keenan, I'm talking to you. Wade, I'm talking to you. Last question coming soon, guys. Keep watching and you might win. Now we will hear from our National Student Services Manager, Fatima Naidu, about student support and student engagement and what you can expect from the brand. Good day. My name is Fatima Naidu and I'm the National Student Services Manager for the IIE's Varsity College. The world is changing faster than it ever has. To succeed in this new and changing world, Students need to go beyond knowledge. The IIE's Varsity College equips students with the skills needed to thrive in the new world. Core to our education philosophy is your holistic development. We encourage and facilitate your balance between studies and participating in a variety of community engagement initiatives. Let me tell you a little bit about student life and the exciting things that you can look forward to. Student engagement is a huge focus of the student services team. And as such, we try to ensure that students are given the opportunity to get involved and become global citizens. We start at home, in the communities around you. Here, you get a chance to use your time and talents to impact the lives of those less fortunate and help fulfill a need. On campus, you will find various committees that will help you use your talents in the best way possible. We have the VC Voice, the Academic, the Social, the Sport, Career Center, and VC Cares Committees. The function of the VC Voice Committee is to promote the interests of the campus student body that it represents, to facilitate communication between students and staff, to create a culture of collaboration, unity, diversity, and belonging among students, to ensure that extracurricular programs such as social, community, sporting and cultural is well organized and inclusive of all students and to encourage student involvement on issues that impact them as it is necessary to build a responsive and holistic student approach on campus. The VC Voice Committee main forum consists of the VC Voice President, Administrator, Chairpersons of the various committees, the International Affairs Representative and School Representatives. The International Forum representative looks after the interests of the international students on campus. This entails assisting international students with campus integration and informing them about support structures available on campus and within the local community. They also provide initial and transitional support as well as 
increasing opportunities for international students to interact with local students. Look out for posters and other communications detailing the international forum events that take place on campus. The VC Voice Academic Forum is a group of students who have been elected by their respective classmates to represent their class voice. These student representatives will interact with senior management team to discuss various student related topics in order to continue and grow and improve the student experience on campus. Keep this in mind if you're looking for leadership opportunities. We all know that a vibrant social calendar is a crucial part of the student experience. Social Meridian hours take place on campus once a week and it is a dedicated one hour slot where no lectures take place. It's your time to interact with your friends outside the classroom and it gives you the opportunity to participate in your various social, cultural and community engagement activities. Open mic sessions provide you with opportunities to demonstrate skills such as singing and dancing, expressing views, reading poetry, or displaying other talents, much to the appreciation and delight of the many students who will gather around to cheer you on and support you. The social committee is responsible for all the social and cultural student events and activities both on and off campus. Some of the funful events include the Sunset Cruise, the Sternmouth VC, the Spring Bash, and end of year parties, and much more. If you enjoy a vibrant social life, then this is the committee for you. Chat to your peer and events coordinator or one of the social committee members to find out about the awesome events, as well as about how you can be a part of the social committee. Remember to join in the fun whilst learning and growing at the same time. If the social scene is not for you, then maybe check out one of the other committees. If you were a part of the Interact Club at your school, or if you've been involved in outreach activities or charity events in the community, then maybe VC Cares is something to explore. VC Cares is a group of students who have a heart for the community. This team assists the Student Relations Manager, also known as your SRM, in planning and implementing events both on campus and in the surrounding communities. BC Cares committee members are a regular face at local children's homes, abused women and children's shelters, the old age homes and animal shelters. Some of the more popular events on the VC Cares calendar, where we partner with NGOs from the community, are the Cancer Shaver Funds, Cancer Relay for Life, Mandela Day revamps of classrooms at underprivileged schools, collections of food and clothing for the homeless shelters, the beach cleanup, donations of stationery and books to our CSI schools, and much needed donations of food and blankets to our animal shelters. VC Cares members are inspired, equipped, and mobilized to make a difference in their world. Not only do their actions help others, it also helps them become happier, more successful adults. If you are interested in getting involved in VC Cares, chat to your SRM or a VC Cares member. Your SRM, with the assistance of the VC Cares Committee, also coordinates awareness campaigns on campus around a variety of issues relevant to you, the student, as well as campaigns that are designed to encourage the campus community to take initiative to learn more about social and community issues. Sharing information through campaigns often ignites ongoing healthy communication about certain topics which increase awareness. These campaigns are run throughout the academic year with monthly event calendars detailing events in high traffic areas on campus. They are fun and interactive and include themes such as adjusting to tertiary life, diversity and inclusion, sexual health and orientation, alcohol and drug abuse, gender-based violence, toxic relationships and bullying. We believe that being aware could be the first step in the prevention process. This new chapter of your life can sometimes be challenging and adjusting might prove to be more difficult than anticipated. We know this and we understand that there are some areas that you can navigate without any issues and there are other times when you will be feeling overwhelmed and anxious. For this very reason, we have an SRM on each campus. The SRM is a professional and experienced on-campus student counselor tasked with promoting your holistic development and wellness during your studies with us. Your SRM is available to discuss any important personal concern you may be facing both professionally 
and confidentially, and to then work with you to develop new ways of resolving or managing your personal concerns. Your SRM offers free short-term primary counseling and psychotherapy with the aim of ensuring that the impact of personal, emotional, and psychological problems you may experience is minimal in terms of the academic aspect of your life so that you can perform optimally. Your SRM will provide you with a toolkit that will benefit you on a personal and academic level. Counseling will include an assessment of the situation, brief counseling sessions of up to three, ses up to three sessions, and a referral to an appropriate off-campus professional should long-term or specialized counseling be necessary. Counseling inc includes both individual face-to-face -face or online counseling, as well as group counseling sessions. All aspects of counseling will be regarded as strictly confidential by your SRM. The SRM on your campus is there to ensure your overall wellness. If you are feeling lost, lonely, anxious, or just overwhelmed, please book an appointment with your SRM who will gladly assist. The Career Center is a work readiness center. They aim to prepare you for the working environment. Employers are looking for graduates who have gained work experience while studying. This is why you need to access the Career Center even in your first year. Find your Career Center coordinator on campus and access the Career Center platform online or via the VC app. Explore the content on the platform and book a consultation online with your Career Center coordinator for individual career support. The Career Center Coordinator can help you with developing your CV, preparing for an interview, applying for part-time jobs, and mapping out your career goals. Get in touch with your Career Center Ambassadors on campus to stay informed of any career fairs, workshops, or Career Center events. Working with your Career Center is a great opportunity to get a head start on employability, even if you're unsure of what career you're interested in or what your long-term goals are come in for a chat. They will support you every step of the way. This might seem like a lot of information, but don't worry, we have support structures in place to help you. VC Assist is your online customer relations platform, which provides you with direct access to VC Customer Relations Center. They are there to help you with any form of timetabling, lecture queries, finance to admission queries, and any campus-related information that you might need. You can access VC Assist via the Student Hub. You also have the VC app, which is accessible to all students. It is software which can be used on multiple devices, including smartphones and tablets. This app is a quick and efficient tool which campuses use to extend the reach of important and interesting communication to the wider student body. Please use the VC app and stay informed and up to date with the latest communication, important calendar and campus events, sport updates, news feeds and photographs. The VC app can be downloaded via the Apple iStore or Play Store. Many people will say that this is the best time of your life. Realistically, it comes down to what you make of it. It is a time to make lifelong friends, discover a new passion or hobby, or find a new experience you enjoy. With all the commitments and difficult exams for which you need to study, it does not really seem to be a fun period of life. However, if you look at things from a different angle, at the end, you will definitely come to the same conclusion. Of course, one should have boundaries when it comes to anything in life but we are going to help you and give you some good reasons that prove that campus life is truly the most interesting part of your journey. Studying will be one of the most intense periods of your life. A whole new horizon will open up in front of your eyes and the lessons that you will learn will not only come from the books that you read. The best lessons come when you successfully overcome all the problems and obstacles tasks and obligations that studying brings, and you are finally able to say that you are a grown up. You will gradually change every single day you spend as a student. Do not be surprised if you start your academic education as one person and finish it as another, usually a better one. Let us come alongside you as you embark on this next adventure. We look forward to seeing you on campus and we can't wait to see what your time with us brings.
So guys, I wish I could give everyone a superfluous voucher. You know, I wish I could have everyone dripping by the end of this year. But unfortunately, I only have one last voucher to give away. And for this last prize, I thought I should just go through the live chat and see who I see mo most often, you know, the, the most interactive person on this live chat. And so many of you guys are chatting, so many guys are, are replying, getting each other's numbers, getting into those group, making new friends. But there's particular people who keep responding to everyone's message. So for the last superfluous voucher, I will be giving it to, away to, ready for it? Kayla B. Congratulations to you, Kayla. I hope you enjoy the Superbulous voucher. I hope, I hope you love it. I hope you buy the freshest clothes on Superbulous. Anyway, guys, don't be in despair. There's more prizes to give away. It's bursaries. You know, I know par parents like are now on high alert. Don't worry, guys. Stay tuned. Stay chatting. You know, I'm, I, I keep reading the comments in the live chat. You guys, are, you guys are actually getting to know each other. But yeah, stay tuned. I've got more prizes to give away. You've got, we've got time to speak to some students today. So don't worry about it. Kayla, please in, email info at varsitycollege.co.za with your handle and you will be sent your prize. Keep watching, guys. You will now hear a little bit more about the campus that you have shown an interest in amongst others from our Heads of Student Services. Please note, we will be presenting various campuses available within the different regions. Our Heads of Student Services will fill you in about the sports and social opportunities available to you and some of the social activities students can get excited about. Hello, I'm Lucy and I'm part of the Head Student Services team at the IAE's Varsity College in the KZN region. I'm delighted to have this opportunity to share the experience of studying at our KZN campuses. Let me tell you about where our three KZN campuses are situated. Durban is a laid back and friendly city with a warm subtropical climate, awesome sandy beaches, and the beautiful Indian Ocean. Durban North and Westville campuses are situated about 18 kilometers apart close to the beaches. Whether you are happiest at one with nature, chasing an adrenaline rush, exploring new sights and sounds, relaxing on the beach, or shopping until you drop, Durban has something for everyone. From beautiful botanic gardens, to art galleries, to the Moses Mabida Soccer Stadium, and Durban's Golden Mile, there is plenty to see and do. The Sharka Marine World, the fifth largest aquarium in the world, is a top attraction with water slides, beautiful marine wildlife, restaurants, and much more. Durban is also home to Gateway Theatre of Shopping, the largest shopping mall in the Southern Hemisphere. Located just outside of Durban Central, our Westfall campus is situated among the green hills of the Westfall suburbs. The campus is conveniently located near sports fields, recreational facilities, and shopping malls. The campus has a relaxed, laid-back atmosphere with a strong focus on academics. Only two kilometers from Durban's Golden Mile, our Durban North Campus is a safe, modern space set amongst extensive sports fields where students can enjoy rugby, hockey, and numerous other outdoor activities. Situated 90 kilometers inland from Durban, Peter Maritzburg is a city steeped in history and surrounded by beautiful countryside. The city is home to renowned museums, art galleries, and attractive architecture. PMB is also where the grueling Comrades Marathon either starts or ends each year. The Doozy Canoe Marathon, which is synonymous with the city, starts in Peter Maritzburg, and PMB is on the doorstep of the Midmar Dam, which hosts the annual swimming event, the Midmar Mile. PMB has the advantage of being a close drive to the countryside, with the Midlands meander being one of the most beautiful parts of South Africa. The infamous Nelson Mandela capture site also forms part of the Midlands meander and is visited by thousands of local and international tourists each year. The PMB campus is located on the lush grounds of St. Charles's College. 
Historically significant buildings and lecture halls open directly onto beautifully manicured lawns, while state-of-the-art security and safety systems ensure the well-being of our students. For those of you who are from out of town and seeking accommodation, we have a partnership with Digs Connect, who will provide you with an online platform where you can access varying types of accommodation within an eight kilometer radius of all VC campuses. Dix Connect is South Africa's largest online student accommodation marketplace. Searches can be filtered by price and preference to suit your needs and budget. For more information, please visit www.dixconnect.com. Our KZN campuses are available on local transport routes, and we also offer secure student parking on campus. Many of our students opt for the greener option, which is to join lift clubs to travel to and from campus, which also saves on the financial front. Let me tell you about sports at Varsity College. The VC Sports Club has activities for everyone, catering for the semi-professional sports person, social athlete, the team player, or the individual sportsmen and women. Learning goes beyond the lecture room, and we believe that finding the right balance between academics and sport contributes to overall success and helps you develop the skills you need to thrive in the new world. There are two different types of sports clubs, national sports clubs, which vary within the regions, and campus-based sports clubs. In the KZN region, we offer rugby, hockey, and water polo. Students from all three campuses can join these national clubs. Within rugby, we have three senior teams and two under-20 teams that participate in the Premier KZN League. In 2019, the club won more trophies than any other Premier League team in KZN. Each year, we send a student team to the USA Championship Tournament, where we participate in the A2 League. Our hockey club is a student-only club that participates in the KZN Super League. We have two men's and two ladies' teams, and our first team participate at the USA Championships each year in the A-League. In 2019, we had 21 players selected for the KZN teams, six South African representatives and one Namibian rep in both indoor and outdoor hockey. The water polo at Varsity College has shared a long run of successes in the past few years winning no less than four titles back to back. Our students continue the success at the USA Championships, where we compete in the A section. We also offer campus-based sports, the majority of which are offered across all three KZN campuses. KZN is home of the Doozy Canoe Marathon, where our canoe club students have excelled, winning age group titles and achieving top 10 finishes. We also compete at the Fish River Canoe Marathon, which is also the USA Championship title race. These top achieving students are on hand to help beginners learn how to paddle at our weekly practices. So please do come on down and join us. Surf skiing is another form of paddling offered under our Varsity College Canoe Club. Students can learn to surf ski both in the river and in the sea. Practices are held weekly and Varsity College will lend the equipment for those students starting the sport for the first time. So there's no excuse not to get involved. Durban has the best weather all year round and riding a wave is one of the most exhilarating feelings in the world, or so I've been told. Our surf club students offer surfing lessons each week for those new to the sport, as well as a more relaxed surf session with our advanced surfers. The team of surfers competes each year at the USA Surfing Championship held in Vic Bay. Action Soccer is our biggest social sports club and students participate in the internal VC Action Soccer League. Varsity College students make up their own teams to compete for the overall Campus League Championship trophy. Our golf club meets for weekly practices and whether you have a low handicap or you are more of a social golfer, we encourage you to join us. While our top golfers sharpen their skills and aim to make the USA Championship team, the weekly driving range sessions are available to students looking to start playing golf and better their swing. We also offer action netball and a touch rugby league, 
as well as the opportunity to join our mountain biking clubs. All are welcome. Esports is making waves nationally with our newly acquired consoles serving both Xbox and PS4 fanatics, with frequent tournaments taking place within and between campuses. FIFA has been successfully rolled out across all of our IIE VC campuses, and we look forward to growth within esports. Westville Campus also hosts a running club, which alternates their runs each week, from easy road running routes to fun and more demanding trail routes on the eco trails based at the Westville Campus. Facilities are available at Westville Campus for squash, and PMB has a strong triathlon club, which represents Varsity College in track and field and competes in the KZN leagues under an official club. Our campus sports clubs are run by administrators, chosen for their passion for sport and their social nature. They are patient and willing to teach first timers, beginners and novices, but can often hang in there with the best in their field. In addition to offering an awesome selection of sports, we know how important it is for students to have a healthy social life. And we therefore offer an array of social and cultural events which meet the needs of our diverse student body. This starts with Orientation Week, otherwise known as O Week. O Week is held annually for first year students to introduce them to campus life and includes academic, social and cultural events on and off campus. It's a great opportunity to make friends and learn more about life at VC. O Week is guaranteed to be fun and we ensure that we cater for our diverse student population. Whether you are more inclined to seek out community projects, cultural events or parties, we offer it all. Our PR and events coordinators and the social committees on campus are responsible for creating a fun social environment for our students to be a part of. Meridian hours take place once a week at midday. And this is where different portfolios and student committees interact with the wider student body, offering events, fun competitions or exciting exhibitions. Some popular Meridian Hour events include the annual Valentine's Day event, Giant Twister, and Minute to Win It games, not to mention the food eating competitions. We also celebrate music, culture, poetry, and other talents from within the student body during Meridian Hour, as well as hosting external acts on campus. Social events take place both on and off campus, and some of our more popular events recently include campus talent shows, sunset cruises, drive-in movie nights, and open mic. We have a wealth of talent on our campuses, and open mic and talent shows are the perfect platform to celebrate our students. These events always pull in a big crowd, who are treated to an evening of singing, dancing, poetry, and more. At the end of a busy year, our students celebrate all their hard work with an awesome evening at our year-end functions, which is a great opportunity to get dressed up and have some fun. Students enjoy an evening filled with music and entertainment, and much energy is given to coordinating with the chosen theme. As you can see, life at the IIE's Varsity College has much to offer. KZN is a really friendly, warm and laid-back region. And we look forward to welcoming you to our beautiful KZN campuses next year so you can share in the sunshine and enjoy campus life with us. It was my very first option to come to Boston College, Durban North. Moved to Durban to further my studies. I get to speak to more people and get to know more people. It's all about the connection. The fact that our class is so small allows me to engage with my lecturer. We've got such passionate lecturers. They take it to the next level. They find ways in which we can better understand the topic that we're learning. They tailor their approach based on our personalities. They connect whatever that we study with what's going on in reality. Durban has got quite a lot of things that you could do. Besides Ushaka, we've also got Moses Mavida. You can go surfing or biking on our promenade that we have. It's got such a great vibe. We've got unlimited Wi-Fi on campus, which allows us to deal with anything. If you want to download things that are related to schoolwork, is available for us. Anything that we need, we go through a VC portal, which has everything there for us. We've got a computer lab which allows for students that don't have laptops to finish their assignments or any work that needs to be dealt with. For those that don't want to really be disturbed, you just sit in the quiet lab. 
The Korea Center is a department on campus that allows students to get part-time jobs or full-time jobs. They help network us to people in our industries. There's extramural activities like joining a sports club, joining the student liaison body, or Varsity College Cares. Varsity College is a brand of the Independent Institute of Education, the IAE. It makes sense to study here at Varsity College Peter Maritzburg because the learning is very intimate and that's something that definitely appeals to someone like me who's sporty, outgoing and full of life. There's that intimacy in our classrooms. Everyone knows one another and everyone gets along well with the lecturers. It's really great to have lecturers who have that industry knowledge. We have the knowledge and also the practical side, which is really great. Varsity College is very technologically advanced. Everything we do is all online and we've got our student portals online where we find past papers. The career centre is where you're handing your CV and they help you find a job. A lot of our students leave campus and are in working positions. We offer quite a number of sports, action soccer, action cricket, trail running, as well as cycling. At Varsity College we have a team called VC Cares that do fundraising. Our main one was the Kobeka Bike Fund. We're always reaching out towards the community. We basically hang out at our canteen on campus. We've also got a pool table in there, which is really great. The SLB are a group that help create a fun social environment on campus. We have a Meridian Hour every Wednesday where we organise fun events for students. Peter Maritzburg is really a great environment. One of the places I enjoy going to is the Nature Reserve. Varsity College has really gone the extra mile in ensuring that we're always up to date with everything that we do. They always ask how things are going and to me that's really incredible. Varsity College is an educational brand of the Independent Institute of Education, the IIE. I started off at a large university and you just remember I chose the Westville campus because the lecturer knows you, they know anything and everything about you. Our classes are very small, it's very easy to ask questions and to get the lecturer to teach you in a more personal way. My lecturer, he's got industry experience, he gives us so much knowledge about the working world and how to apply to what we're studying. We do have a lot of computer labs. We have a platform called VC Learn where everything is online. It does help with integrating our learning that we do in our lecture. The Career Centre teaches you what they can do for you if you need internships or extra work for weekends. We have our cafeterias and we have our courtyards. A lot of the students often hang out there. We do have a lot of different sports clubs. We even have surfing. You all meet at the beach. The SLB is the student liaison body. Our responsibility is to ensure that the students want to come to parties, have a good time. BCKS does a lot of charity work and each year we select a different charity to sponsor or to donate or to help. Westville is community orientated. We're 20 minutes from the beach. Kranzkloer from Nature Reserve is an awesome place to go hiking. The whole vibe of Varsity College I think is very different. Everybody always wants to make sure that you are getting the best education and be 100% okay. Varsity College is a brand of the Independent Institute of Education, IIE. Hi, my name is Tim Michael Vern and I'm the Head of Student Services at the IIE's Varsity College Waterfall Campus. Welcome to you, our prospective student, and I hope you are enjoying your virtual open day experience. Today, I want to showcase our amazing campuses, which are located in Gauteng, as well as the sporting and social experience you can look forward to at each campus, including what accommodation options we have available to you. Without further ado, let's get into it. First up, we have the IIE's Varsity College Pretoria campus, which is situated in an upmarket residential area where the streets are lined with the purple haze of jacaranda trees. As South Africa's capital, Pretoria is well known for being an academic city with a vibrant student life. The aspect which makes the IIE's Varsity College Pretoria campus uniquely amazing is the beautiful Moraletta Sprite, a tranquil river which flows right through the campus grounds. This beautiful body of water can be witnessed by students who walk over the bridge on their way to class. 
The trees growing near the river provide ample shade, together with the sounds of the flowing water, which creates a serene spot to stop and relax on breaks. Pretoria boasts beautiful suburbs with attractions that include the Union Buildings, the Pretoria National Botanical Gardens, Strubens Bird Sanctuary, Menland Main, Menland Mall, and many more sites with amazing activities to take part in. Next up, we have the IIE's Varsity College Waterfall Campus, which is located in the heart of Madrid. The Waterfall Campus is said to look more like Google headquarters than that of a typical university, with state-of-the-art academic lecture rooms and computer facilities, which are brought to life by bright and vibrant spaces, providing not only a stimulating study environment, but an oasis for inspiration. The Waterfall Campus has tranquil gardens to relax in, as well as our own campus eatery, Olives and Plates, where you can grab a delicious meal or snack with your friends. Midrand is full of fun and exciting attractions, such as the Lori Park Zoo, the Kailami Racetrack, the Mall of Africa, which is South Africa's largest mall ever built in a single phase, home to over 300 local and international brands. Finally, we introduce the IIE's Varsity College Santon Campus, positioned in the bustling and energetic suburb of Benmore Gardens. Santon, the richest square mile in Africa, not only with regards to wealth, but also culture and diversity. Josie, as it is locally referred to, has planted over 10 million trees, making it the biggest man-made forest in the world. This is where you will find our largest campus a sprawling complex within secure grounds that boasts a thoughtful designed student environment with a magnificent view overlooking Santon City. Santon is a vibrant and dynamic city within a city, offering a wide array of top entertainment and dining experiences, which can be located in Santon City, Nelson Mandela Square, FNB Stadium, Goldry City Theme Park, Soweto Towers and Vilakazi Street. A very important part of your student's experience is keeping active and having the option to play a sport that best suits you and your style as an individual. Learning goes beyond the lecture room. We believe that finding the right balance between academics and sports contributes to the overall academic success and helps you develop the skills you need to thrive in the new world. Keeping active and building team spirit is what it's all about. The VC Sports Club has activities for everyone, catering for semi-professionals, social athletes, team players, or individual sportsmen and women. You need to register to join the VC Sports Club and pay an annual fee, which includes access to certain leagues, plus a limited edition VC Sports Club t-shirt. There are two different types of sports clubs, national sports clubs, which are centers of excellence for the IIE's Varsity College, located in one particular region. And second are the campus-based sports. Not every campus offers the same sports. Varsity College offers a wide array of sporting disciplines, comprising of action sports, which are fast-paced adrenaline pumping sessions. Some of these sports include indoor hockey, netball, softball, football, and cricket. For those of you who are more inclined to endurance and obstacle course racing, the multi-sports club is definitely for you. With weekly sessions offered on Pretoria, Waterfall and Santon campus in each of our disciplines, running, cycling and mountain biking and obstacle course racing, students can easily jump in and keep themselves fit. Our monthly trips to the events in Gauteng also allows you to get competitive and push you to get your team, as well as yourself, over that finish line. The Pretoria and Santon campus offers a wide variety of field sports, such as touch rugby, football, golf, volleyball, and softball. The Varsity College Softball Club has truly become the highlight of sports at the Pretoria campus. We also offer chess at selected campuses for students who wish to hone their strategic skills. Another big sport we have introduced is eSports. eSports is the fastest growing sport in the world, which has finally reached our waterfall, Samson and Pretoria campuses. We offer FIFA, Call of Duty, Apex Legends and many more. Everything you need to take part in eSports is available to you on these particular campuses. 
from gaming consoles to powerful network capabilities. All you need to do is jump in and grab hold of this competitive space. The Varsity College campuses in Gauteng all host special sports awards evenings for those who excel in their specific sport. This is hosted by celebrity MCs and always go along with good food. This also provides an opportunity to all competitors to congratulate their fellow team members on all the hard work our sportsmen and women have put into the year. The VC Sports Clubs are managed by the Campus Sports Coordinators, who appoint club administrators to run each sport on campus. These club administrators are supported by the VC Sports Club Committee, who are responsible for marketing and advertising all the sports clubs on campus. Carl Krishnan is the Campus Sports Coordinator who manages sports at the Pretoria campus, and Jared Margot heads up sport for Santon and Waterfall campuses. Another important thing to note is that there are various sporting bursaries on offer at the Waterfall, Santon and Pretoria campuses, should you qualify. So don't forget to chat to your campus sports coordinators to find out more. Your tertiary experience will be one of the most exciting and memorable times of your life. So what better way to celebrate than taking part in all the fun social events that Varsity College has to offer. The social experience at the IIE's Varsity College is an important pillar aimed at creating an holistic approach to academics and social life balance, building character and instilling confidence within our students. The initial starting point of your social journey begins at O-Week. The IIE's Varsity College has one of the most exciting and eventful student orientation weeks available. This fun-filled week happens around the country on all eight campuses at the same time and is an opportunity for us to welcome you as a new student and introduce you to what Varsity College is, what is all about. It includes fun activities such as Wet and Wild, inter-faculty tournaments, O-games, student information sessions, campus tours, an opening address evening and lots more. Varsity College has a special hour dedicated to you, the students, every Wednesday called Meridian Hour. These students can take the opportunity to engage in social and cultural activities designed to give them a break from their academically focused demands. Some of these Meridian Hours consist of Minute to Win It, Fear Factor, Idols, Battle of the DJs, and the list goes on. The social committee on each campus works with the student body to plan and implement awesome and fun on-campus as well as off-campus events. Some of these events include BC's Got Talent, which is an event that allows all students the opportunity to demonstrate their gifts in a formal showcase. This exciting event is something that students look forward to most in participating and attending. Mr. and Ms. VC is a formal event that students at the IIE Varsity College Pretoria campus take pride in attending, an opportunity to showcase themselves as well as the beauty they possess within displaying their unique qualities. This event will have Mr. and Ms. VC chosen, who will take part in various charitable events throughout the year and set an example to their fellow peers. All proceeds from this event are donated to charity. The Waterfall and Santon Campus students enjoy the bustling nightlife scene by attending awesome themed parties at some of Joburg's most popular clubs and lounges, dancing the night away to some of SA's hottest DJs and performers. The Social Committee is a student-based committee that plans and runs fun interactive events for the entire student body to enjoy. You too could apply to join this committee and gain valuable experience in organizing events, participating in community outreach, and incorporating your vision of a fun and vibrant student environment. The social committee at all three campuses works in tandem with the VC Cares team on various charitable events throughout the year to ensure the students have an opportunity to give back to their surrounding communities. Some of these initiatives comprise of the shave in support of cancer, donating much needed food and clothing, as well as toys to local children's homes, raising proceeds through fun on-campus bake sales and markets, and putting together sanitary packs for Women's Day, and finally volunteering at local animal shelters. Another aspect you will need to consider 
is where you would like to stay and what accommodation options are ava available to you. The IIE's Vast College of Victoria, Waterfall and Sanson campuses have all partnered up with Dix Connect to assist students in finding the safest and most convenient accommodation near their preferred campus. Dix Connect is South Africa's largest online student accommodation marketplace. Searches can be filtered by price and preferred accommodation types to suit your needs and budget. All three of the Gauteng campuses have additional accommodation options available, which are situated within walking distance of major bus routes, as well as car train stations across the region. At the IRE's Varsity College, we pride ourselves on creating a balanced and memorable student experience for you and the student life. Through our carefully crafted academic schedules that enable you to participate in sporting activities and attend and participate in fun social events to ensure we give you the best shot possible in terms of achieving your goals. I hope I have given you a bit more insight into the different IIE Varsity College campuses in Gauteng, each with their very own unique charm and exciting and diverse environment. Now it's up to you to pick the campus that best suits you so you can take your life to the next level. And remember, we're preparing you for the unpredictable. That's New World Thinking. Think about it. The world's largest hotel chain doesn't own any property. And the biggest taxi company has no cars. The only way to thrive in this topsy-turvy world is to ask the right questions. Will the institution you study at model you for the past or prepare you for the future? Think about it, because at the IIE's Varsity College, that's what we do every day. Why is the sky blue? How do fish breathe in the water? Are that shadows made of? Why can't I see my eyes? But why can't we change that? At the IIE's Varsity College, our students are ready for the new world. My favorite thing about studying at Varsity College Pretoria is that I made people like me. You are bound to just fit in. It feels like you're within family. The classes at Varsity College are very small. You feel like you get more attention. We get more interaction with our lecturer. I have interesting lecturers, I must say. They put in effort when it comes to teaching us. They want to make sure that you understand what you're doing. We have four computer labs. The VC portal is where you see your school marks, your modules. We have the library. It's an environment where you can go to do your schoolwork. At Varsity College, there's a great balance between work and play. The cafe is where everyone can hang out. You can have your food, you can play some pool. We have the outdoor areas. It's under trees with picnic tables. I'm in the SRB and I'm the head of social. As soon as I know it's a Wednesday, it's Meridian hour, it's my playtime. I have to make sure students are having fun. The career center is where students can find part-time jobs and it gives you experience. VC Cares is our charity work. They tell us what we need to gather, what money we need to raise for charities. The sports we have at Varsity College is so many. There's soccer and netball. We have a sports event called InterVarsity where all the Varsity Colleges come together. In Pretoria, we have the nature reserve. Every restaurant you can ask for and nightclubs. When you leave high school, you're going through tertiary phase. You want to grow, and at Varsity College, you grow quickly. Varsity College is an educational brand of the Independent Institutes of Education, the IIE. Hi, guys. So... Right now, we're going to be hearing from the horse's mouth, guys. I want you guys to not just listen to me or the lecturers or the people of the departments of the school just tell you about how great the school is. I want you to, to hear from people who were in your position a couple of years ago. We're going to talk to students who are at Varsity College right now, and you guys will get to ask them questions. It's going to be a Q&A session between you guys and them. And I, I have some questions that you guys might have uh, given me earlier. And if you have new questions that you want to think of, that you want to ask uh, our panel right here, uh, go ahead. Tell, tell, uh, ask us the questions in the, in, the, in the group chat. 
So um, I'm going to introduce our panel, and we have five people in our panel uh, who are students at Varsity College right now, actually. We have Matthew from our Durban North Campus, Kiata from our Santin, we have Kiara, Kiata from our Santin Campus, Bridget from our Waterfall Midran Campus, Trustworth from our Pretoria Campus, and Nazreen from our Port Elizabeth Campus. Hey guys, how are you doing? Good, good, and you? Good, Nice. Students um, for next year. Uh, let's let's start with Matthew. What made you decide on the IIE's Varsity College? Well, for me, leaving high school. Uh, there were so many universities hearing people where they want to go and looking at the different qualifications, you know, Varsity College suited me not only for the qualification, but also for the culture of the campus. You know, it's not just you walk in, you get a qualification and you leave. It's, there's a sport to it. There's a social aspect to it. They, they, they nurture you and help you to get your, to go out and get a great job. Once your qualification is done, there's a whole lot of platforms to speak to and to, to relate and to bond with the staff members as well. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, uh, for, one, for our next question, I'm going to ask Bridget, right? Bridget, what is the student life like at the IIE's Varsity College? I think uh, definitely it's about the vibe. <laughs> uh, there's a balanced life between um, your studies and actually living the life of what people perceive a student to live. Um, we promote a healthy, stability, like stable relationship between venturing through your social, sport, and education with VC. Um, speaking about a balanced life, Trustworth, should st students get involved in sports and social aspects of, of, of Varsity College? Like, would you recommend that? Definitely. Um, you know, school, school is a lot, you know, so you need that... That's stress reliever, if you could say. And, um, you know, sports is definitely one of those things that can, you know, help you to basically do that. And obviously from a social perspective, you know, um, yeah, you can't be all books and all players. So, you know, you need to have, you need to find that balance most definitely. I get you. I get you. I get you. Um, let's say, uh, Nazreen, what, what types of social activities can students get excited about? Um, there's a lot. Uh, I would definitely say the main one for the year, um, Mr. and Miss v, uh, VC. Um, there's also, we have VC's Got Talent. There's the end of year social function, which is also something to look forward to. Um, there's many social events that are carried throughout the year. Um, so, yeah, we've got a very broad um, events and activities that students' perspectives can look forward to. Okay. Um, I'm going to ask you guys one more question. Um, Matthew, how did you decide uh, where you wanted to study, what you wanted to study, and where you wanted to study after grade 12? Like, how do you make that decision? Because there's maybe people in the live chat right now who are still at this stage don't know what they should study next year. Yeah. Yeah. So for me, um, I, I, I live in Durban, by the way, guys. Um, so I knew I wanted to go into something more on the corporate, but still marketing, advertising, where you still deal with people. And Varsity College offer um, the Bachelor of Arts Corporate Communications degree. That's what I study. And if I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure another university offers that specific degree. And I was taken aback by that. I was blown away. My mind was made on that. And in terms of where I wanted to study, obviously, yeah, in case in these three different varsity college campuses, but the Durban North one with that, that was the, that's the biggest one that we have. And that was, I wanted to get as involved as possible and meet as many people as I can. And that was the campus for me. Perfect. Perfect. Bridget, what is the role of lecturers? Like how do they help students at varsity college? Skilled in the field that they lecture. They usually have experience within the field. Um, so when they come forward to teaching us, it's actually more of like a personal experience that they bring forward while educating you so that you can understand the environment that you're going to put yourself in come future. 
Um, so yeah, I think lectures are very one-on-one, -on -one, especially because our class is also small. It's it's great. Um, thank you so much, uh, Kiata. Do you have any tips on how to f survive your first year at varsity? I must say, to survive your first year of varsity, it's very difficult. It is very different to high school. Um, don't get too caught up in the social aspect of the vibe on Varsity College campus. It's very easy. Everyone's really fun. Everyone knows each other. It's a very friendly environment. But to play hard, you've got to work hard. So as long as you keep on top of all your work throughout the year, you'll definitely, you, you're going to make it. You just have to make sure that you do your things every day and you keep on top of everything. So let me ask uh, Trust with this question. Uh, what has been the biggest change for you between like high school and tertiary education? What would you say is the biggest jump, biggest uh, shock, shock to to students? Okay, so um, obviously coming into to university, I mean, let me start back at high school. You in matric, you like the the big fish in the school, the top dog and everything else. You come to university and you get shut on real quick. You know what I mean? So, you know, just adjusting to that to realize that I'm not the big cat anymore. You know, there's, there's all sorts of different types of people here. So, I mean, just the way and everything's structured from the lessons to how we interact with each other and so forth. Um, I think that was probably the biggest shock. But nonetheless, I mean, once you, once you get in, it, it doesn't really take you too long to adjust. Um, you know, obviously, the key thing is just keeping your feet on the ground, um, listening, um, it's very important, you know, make sure that you have the right people around you. And yeah, other than that, yeah, then you'll be all good. Oh, perfect. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much. You guys are great, by the way, answering all my questions. Maybe the last final question that I'm taking from the group chat right now. Do you have any quick study tips as students prepare for the trial and final grade 12 exams? Any of you guys can answer this. Any tips that you can give a grade 12 right now? Because it's even worse. They're studying at home, most of them. I would say um, definitely have a plan. Stick to it. Be consistent. Um, remember that one hour each day is more effective than 10 hours the night before. So, you know, keep going. I know that you guys are at the end and kind of lost it, but finish off strong. Do you guys have any more advice for them? Because hey, it's tough. Definitely, um, keep yourself or make yourself a study timetable. Yeah. I must say that that's helped me a lot in high school and it helped me a lot at varsity. Um, make sure to give yourself enough time to study for an exam, like Najreen said, and plan it all out. Plan it in months in advance so you're not super stressed when it comes to exam time. If I could also add there, sure. um, my colleagues have mentioned some really good points. I think right now, you know, metric is um, the way it's painted to everyone. It's, it's it is a big deal. But I think, you know, with the media and your parents' pressure on the side, there's just a lot of voices that are going into your head right now. One thing that I could just really encourage the students is you've got a mission, you've got a job, and that's doing all at your exams. Stick to that. Everything else, just kind of shut it out. You know what I mean? Because um, once you allow that unnecessary pressure to get in it kind of distracts you from everything else that you need to do so as the guy said you know make sure you have a plan make sure you you stick to it effectively but above all else you know keep your eyes locked in to what you need to do and that's passing your exams everything else can take a back seat great advice great advice um guys i just want to know what type of support can students expect from the iie's varsity college during their acad academic journey? Like, what support do you guys get and what support can they uh, expect from uh, uh, VC? Matthew, you can, you can take this one. Yeah, so in terms of the lecturers, like we touched on, that, that in itself, they, it's not just your lecturers there and the time ends, the lecturer leaves. They're always there for help. You can approach them if you have any issues. When I was in first year, we had tutors from the third year students. So they were in our position two years prior to that. And they help you. They, they, you can ask them questions you might be too afraid to ask in class or anything like that. And then that's on the, obviously on the work side. And then obviously we have, um, we have committees on campus for anyone that wants, if you 
if you want to get involved socially or in the charity or career wise there's there's a whole lot of committees that are also students just like the first years just like yourselves which is very easy to approach and they're here to help with anything you want that you need help with perfect 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 just a random question guys how easy is it to how is it is it to make friends there like do you guys get time to socialize and stuff like that like uh, oh no it's perfect isn't it Everyone seems to make friends really early in the morning if you want to skip the traffic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I know. Yeah, I know. At, at Varsity College, we also they have the Meridian Hour, which is your social hour, mm -hmm. which is where you're encouraged to actually go out. You leave your class, you go out, meet people. There's games being played in the quiet. Um, committees have their own hours, and that's literally to make friends, to engage, so that you can get that student social life. Oh, that's, that's perfect. That's perfect. Oh, that's dope. That's something that we have right at the beginning of the year. Okay. And, you know, there's just a whole array of different events that you can obviously participate in. And that's your time to network. I mean, some of the friends that I have, I'm in third year now. I mean, those are the guys that I met during all week, you know, and we just really, we clicked it off from there. So, you know, every single opportunity that you get, whatever events that um, the campus puts forward, my advice would be, you know, attend them um, to the best of your ability. And um, that's, that's where you'll be able to network and make friends. Oh, perfect. Perfect, guys. Perfect. Oh, you guys are giving me great answers, actually. <laughs> um, what, what years are you guys all in? Uh, trust that you said th third year, right? Yeah, yeah that's year. correct. And then Matthew? Third year as well. Third, are all of you guys third year? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wow, okay. <laughs> now, you, we have legends here. We have people who know what what they what they're talking about okay no guys thank you so much for all, for asking all these questions i think we got a just like an understanding of how varsity college life is uh guys uh i'm, I'm even looking through the comments right now people want to ask so many questions and people want to get to hear from you guys more but i don't think uh i think i'm running out of time actually i think i've uh let me see if can i just ask for, like two more questions guys ask me two more questions and then we, we, we we're done Literally, we're done. Um, one person is here is asking, uh, do you guys, do, do any of you guys play any sports in the, in the, in the school? And how is that experience? Yeah, so um, Varsity College actually has a lot of sports. Yeah. Um, I can speak specifically for the Santon campus. We have a lot of sports. We have rugby, we have touch rugby, we have netball, we have a very good football club. There is sports for anyone on the DC campus and the nice thing is is you will join the sports committee and you can play whatever sport you want it's very very social and there's a lot of sporting events within varsity college we have a specific sporting orientation week which is normally after your academic um orientation week and then throughout the year we have inter vc which is very very big and then we also have like camps and stuff like that for the specific sporting codes oh perfect Perfect, guys. Thank you so much. No, thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much. I am, I'm, I'm, I'm just bombarded with questions right now. Everyone wants to know so much things, but I think I've covered the the most of it. Do I have um, any more questions? Yeah. Any any advice that you guys would give them for their time at Varsity College? Just signing off the the last words of advice you guys would give uh, Great Twelves coming into to school next year at Varsity College. As, yeah, you can, we can. You can even um, make it specific to your campus. If if you're from Durban, just tell them specific uh, ad notes about your campus. Or, yeah, I would I would say, guys, it's it's exciting. It's it's going to be one of the best experiences. But just make sure. I was told this in first year. Use all your resources accessible. If there's tutors, go to the tutors. Go to all your lectures. Do your work. Don't pre-read for lectures. Um, don't don't like don't miss any tasks. Everything helps you in the end. And before you know it, you'll be in third year. You'll have your degree, and it blows over pretty easily if you just do everything. And yeah, definitely. Mm. Perfect, guys. Thank you so um, much. Yeah, trust with. Okay. Um, yeah, I just thought I'd also just add to what Matthew's saying. I'm from Pretoria, so shout out to all the people that are there in Pretoria. Um, I mean, yeah. At the end of the day, I mean, we had to, to secure the bag. So, you know, when you come onto campus, 
you got to have the mentality, I'm here to secure the bank. You know what I mean? So um, it's really essential. Make sure you attend classes. Um, especially on the days that you don't feel like it. And trust me, you're going to have a ton of those days where you just don't feel like going to class. Listen, but you got to be there. You know what I mean? Um, everything that you need to do, make sure you, you have like a really steady schedule going on and make sure that you tick all those boxes. And um, as everyone said, there's a lot of things that you can obviously do on campus, but always remember academics come first. And I know that's such a parent thing to say, but I mean, at the end of the day, it's the truth. We're on campus so we can secure the bag after all. So gotta, you got to do what you got to do. Perfect. Perfect. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you so much. You, your, your answers were perfect, guys. Uh, I'm just going to say bye to everyone. Bye, Matthew. Bye, Kiata. Bye, Bridget. Trust with and Nazreen. Thank you so much for your time. Your answers were amazing. I think a lot of people feel more confident now that they've heard it from the horse's mouth. And yeah, man, good luck with the rest of your studies, guys. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you, guys. Thank you. So, uh, guys, those, those were students at Varsity College, and you heard it from them. There's a nice vibe. Just don't get too distracted. It's easy to get lost in the sauce, you know, as you guys would say. But thank you so much to everyone who, who asked a question, and we hope most of your questions were answered. Anyway, guys, so I've given away three superbulous vouchers, and I told you there's more to give away today, and I, I wasn't kidding. Actually, I've got two bursaries to give away. Um, I've got two bursaries to, to give to two lucky students uh, worth 20,000 rands for tuition support. I know the, 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 the students were paying attention, but now the, the, the parents are like, what? Please do whatever it is possible to get this bursary. But yeah, we've been watching the live chat and we've already picked, chosen our winners. And there's two people who get to walk away today with 20,000 rands towards tuition support so the winners for the bursaries drum roll is the first winner is Peyton Anathian from VC Durban North qualification is law congratulations to you Peyton and our second winner for today is Palisa Mitchell from Santin who's in the qualification of psychology thank you so much guys uh but but don't despair if I didn't call your name. There's six other bursaries that are up for grabs if you booked a, a student session with one of the student advisors. But congratulations to two of our winners. Please info, in, email us at info at varsitycollege.co.za and you will be contacted very shortly, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in, guys. Thank you so much for chatting in the live chat. Continue, guys. I hope you booked your student session with a student advisor and you'll get even more information, guys. Thank you so much, guys. Well, we knew this time was coming, but unfortunately, my amazing people, we have come to the end of my time. Sad, I know, but I hope you've enjoyed our virtual open day and you found it not only fun, but also informative. We have shared so much today. I hope you've learned a little bit more about our educational brand and the opportunities we have to offer. And even though this year's open day was unconventional, we hope we've given you a taste of the wonderful time you will have here and how all of this was possible because here at the IIE's Varsity College, we don't let the world pass us by. We adapt to the ever-changing new world. If there is anything you might need any more information on, don't hesitate to visit us on varsitycollege.co.za. And if you need more engagement, we do have student advisors that are around until 1 p.m. to host student appointments. Chat and engage with them. Thank you so much for bearing through my dad jokes. But for now, stay safe. Stay adapting and we'll see you next year, New World Thinkers. Goodbye.